you'll notice that uh, you will not have weapons in this iteration. We're focusing primarily on your camera work or your communications capability. Help. I'm helping him, sir. I'm helping him. So we got, we got a lot of injects of what the scenario was, what we we're going to be doing, where we'd be set up. Uh, about three days, three days till we started getting our equipment together. We had a bag drag, we made sure everybody had their equipment, yeah, cool. batteries, cameras, yeah, uh, Pelican cases, make sure everybody was good to go. Uh, Stardex on Monday was kind of light, so it kind of gave an introduction to ComCam, introduction to uh, Scorpio Lens, while we broke it up into different phases. I mean, while we did a, a crawl, walk, and run uh, style scenario, uh, those first two days were about classroom, making sure that we had, again, gear checks, what it'd be like in an austere environment, and how we would set the tents and start from there. I think the big factor here was crisis response and how we respond in a different threat environment. Um, it's not about pulling a trigger, right, but using the power of our imagery. I think the biggest thing that I gained from this version of Scorpion Lens versus the previous one, I was brand new to combat camera on the previous Scorpion Lens that I went to, and that one was just super fast paced, which is beneficial on its own, but as a new combat cameraman, I wasn't really sure what the expectations were. So in this scenario where things were broken down and it was really a crawl, walk, run phase, um, it helped learn specifically the skills that we need to know. So information operations wasn't something that I had much knowledge in or battle damage assessment wasn't something that I was super familiar with. So taking it down to basics really, I thought helped understand what our capabilities are and build on them. I noticed it probably could have used the third shooter. I think my team performed great. Um, we had a really awesome team dynamic where people came from different backgrounds, whether it was public affairs or they've been combat camera for a long time. We all pooled our skills and we were able to help each other out. So what I did was I pulled over the original file, unedited. Honestly, I think my favorite part of this experience is just being able to be with the rest of the squadron um, and just pooling experiences. I haven't been in some of those situations and I've definitely learned from those who have. You can lean on us when you're not strong. We'll be your friends. We'll help you carry on.